It's a beautiful night for toilet talk. <laughs> White Sox fired Kenny Williams. White Sox fired Rick Hahn. Hahn is gone with the wind. Messed that up, but I don't care. Ooh. Tuesday's home. Hahn is gone, and so is Kenny Williams. Three weeks after the trade deadline, that doesn't make much sense, Jerry. But I don't care. To new beginnings, don't make Chris Getz your general manager. Because that would be idiotic, Jerry. White Sox finally, finally fired Kenny Williams and Rick Hahn after today they are finally flushed they're gone because they're no longer my fucking problem oh we can flush the toilet again it flushes it flushes thank you for giving me a lot of shitty seasons Rick Hahn and Kenny Williams at least won a title in 05 it just he was with us for 30 years it hasn't worked very often you struck Lightning in a bottle once, long time ago, and that's by good riddance. Like I said, if the White Sox get Chris Getz, it's gonna make me sick. If the White Sox make Chris Getz a vice president or a general manager, I will do 10 shots of wild turkey and I'll cry the whole entire Toilet Talk episode, because that will piss me off, depress me, and just make me want to pull my hair, and that would make me just use the whole goddamn toilet paper roll for how much shit that would be. But it's a happy day for now, since we don't have to worry about them anymore. I don't like, you know, 13 and 29 in the last 42 games. <laughs> Something's not working, Jerry, huh? 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 Maybe we should take the time to dash fail. Nice veil white socks. We can suck baseball. <laughs> suck in baseball in Tennessee. Hee haw. We're gonna send the white socks. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Send them to Nice Vale. Before we can lose, lose, lose every fucking season. Hee haw haw. Socks aren't moving to Nashville. They're gonna stay in Chicago. Chicago. Enough about the White Sox. Enough about them now. It's we're just gonna finish the season off, lose every game possible, fire Pedro Grafal, hopefully, and we can move on to new and better things next season. The rebuild again is here, at least this time with management. Let's get it right, Jerry. Please get it right. You, you finally did this. Even though I'm stupid, I mean, I said we're going to move on with the White Sox, but I do got to mention this one more time. It's August, what, 22nd? Why would you let these guys make the trade deadline move, then fire up three weeks later? Isn't that stupid, Jerry? Stupid, Jerry. Oh, my gosh, that's so stupid, but they're gone. They're gone, and I'm happy. Woo! Oh, man. And then, can we talk about... Uh, I haven't watched it enough, but uh, I think his last name is pronounced Bagent. Bagent. Yell at me, everybody. I don't know how to pronounce the guy's name. Let's take it over as the Bears' backup. Like P.J. Walker had another shitty performance. Doesn't give me any gratification saying it, but I think the Bears' backup quarterback's going to be a problem if Justin Fields goes down either way, but Badgett's doing pretty good. And like I said, if I'm pronouncing his name wrong, please correct me. I haven't watched the preseason game long enough to watch him in. I normally turn off after the first couple drives, at least in game one, to see Fields play. In game two, I was busy most of the day, and when I turned it on, I think I saw the Bears' defense on there. But football, we're literally, I think, a week or two weeks away, two weeks exactly from Thursday, and then two weeks from Sunday for the Bears. Football season's coming. It's coming and, I, and I'm going to be doing predictions here shortly on um, each week. Maybe I'll do uh, a division each day. I'll give you guys my prediction. And then we'll do a division winners, wild cards, you know, then how the playoffs are going to go. And I, I'm a pretty smart guy. It may not look like it through these talks, but I got good predictions. And I'm going to give them to you here in the following couple weeks. But, uh, yeah, 
most of what I wanted to talk about today was the White Sox. I think I got that message across. I might concuss myself now. Other good things here. Yankees lost their ninth straight game. Love it. Um, the Cubs lost today, but I can't make fun of the Cubs. They're hot. They're really hot. And But they are playing really bad teams. And actually, remember my... Uh, I think I forgot which episode it was. I said the Cubs had an easy schedule and that they could make the playoffs. And unfortunately, I'm becoming right. Even though I'm rooting against them, they are doing pretty well. Today, Drew Smiley pitched, and he's a problem. He makes me smiley, but I know most you Cubs fans are frowny. And, uh, eh, God dang it, what? I just got teed for that. I got technical foul. One more, and I'm. I'm gone, guys. I can't begin texts like that. I'm sorry. Not on my pod. Not on my show. I can't even talk right. I'm so flustered for my technical foul from Frowny. Drew Frowny. Nah, that was... This is some stupid show I got going on here. But take me very serious. I'm a man on a toilet, for God's sakes. On episode... I think this is episode 24. So take me seriously. <laughs> but no. Uh, yep. Cubs are doing good. They're the second wild card team, and I don't see it stopping with it because I think they got the Pirates next, and then the Brewers, which would be a big series. So Cubs are doing really good, and there you go. Not biased. Said they're good. Cubs fans, they're good. Cubs are doing good. Um, and you know, right now we're on a betting hiatus. I think we'll pick up the betting advice on DraftKings once football starts. And we'll get we'll kick that back off, get back into our degenerate selves. And uh yeah, this I know this I didn't have a lot of content for you today, but it's mostly just to celebrate the White Sox GM change. Um, like I said, you guys aren't doing a good job right now, but like and subscribe and tell me what you want me to talk about, and I'll talk about it. If you want me to take 10 shots of wild turkey here, I'll take them. I'll take them. If you want me to, you know, wipe my I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> but you guys have a good night. Thank you, Jerry, for doing one thing right. Why don't you fire yourself next? Let's go. Toilet talk. Like. That's my second team. Presence been ejected.